The Denver Nuggets faced a harsh reality in their NBA Cup match against the New Orleans Pelicans, losing 1-0-1, 9-4 in a game that exposed the limits of their roster depth. Playing without their star center Nikola Jokic and head coach Michael Malone, the reigning champions struggled to maintain cohesion and offensive efficiency, underscoring their reliance on Jokic's playmaking and leadership. Jokic, a two-time NBA MVP, has been the cornerstone of Denver's success, orchestrating the offense with his unrivaled court vision and versatility. His absence due to rest left a gaping hole in the knee gets lineup, forcing the team to recalibrate. Without Malone, who was unavailable due to personal reasons, Denver also lacked its usual sideline leadership, further compounding the challenges. Jamal Murray led the Nuggets' efforts, putting up a respectable 16 points alongside eight, assists and six rebounds. However, it was not enough to compensate for the lack of Jokic's presence. The Nuggets managed just 43% shooting from the field, with lapses in execution and offensive creativity apparent throughout the game. Young players like Christian Braun and Julian Strother were given opportunities to step up, but their performances highlighted a lack of experience against a well-organized Pelicans defense. Denver's bench, which has been instrumental in past games, struggled to provide the scoring punch needed to keep pace. On the other side, the Pelicans capitalized on Denver's vulnerability. Brandon Ingram was instrumental, leading New Orleans with a stellar performance that blended scoring, playmaking, and defensive intensity. The Pelicans showcased a balanced defensive strategy, with several players contributing in double figures. Their bench outperformed Denver's, providing the depth and consistency necessary to close out the game. New Orleans also demonstrated defensive discipline, holding Denver to just 94 points, one of their lowest scoring outings of the season. Their ability to neutralize the Nuggets' offense highlighted a growing maturity and poise within their roster. The loss underscores a critical issue for Denver, their dependency on Jokic. While they have a talented roster, the absence of their star center revealed a lack of secondary playmakers capable of shouldering the offensive load. For the Nuggets, this serves as a wake-up call to bolster their depth and develop alternative strategies to navigate games without their MVP. Malone's absence, though temporary, also emphasized the importance of leadership. His ability to make in-game adjustments and motivate the team has been a key factor in Denver's success, and his presence was sorely missed in this high-stakes matchup. The Nuggets will aim to regroup as they prepare for their next NBA Cup game. With Jokic and Malone likely to return, Denver has a chance to reset and refocus. However, this loss has revealed vulnerabilities that could pose challenges in their quest for back-to-back -back championships. For the Pelicans, this win is a confidence booster, proving their ability to compete with the league's elite. As the NBA Cup progresses, they have positioned themselves as a team capable of making a deep run, provided they maintain their balance and consistency. This game serves as a reminder of how quickly fortunes can shift in the NBA.